Getting ready for the Apollo 8 flight, of course, was hazardous. It was uh, taking a chance, but it was done by people who saw the opportunity to actually go to the moon and accomplish things as a forerunner, necessary though for actually landing on the moon, uh, the navigation all the way to the moon, looking at suitable uh, landing spots, uh, checking out the, the structure of the moon itself and how it affected the orbiting around the moon, you know, where the, we call the mass cons, how the body itself was constructed with regards to its gravity. And so it actually fed in very nicely to uh, what we needed to do. You have to remember, I made two flights. I was interested in rocket technology. I was interested in astronomy as a boy. I, and so my approach to this flight was, you know, this was, this was another mini uh, uh, Lewis and Clark expedition. We're going someplace else. This is great. My companions were not that uh, of the same nature. Uh, 1968 was a very poor year, and uh, that's why in one of the cases on the way out, on the way, Frank Borman got motion sickness. And there was uh, some question about, should we abort? And, uh, and but in my mind, we, we were not going to abort for almost anything. I mean, uh, uh, because this was a, this was a present to the people of the United States after a very poor year that we are going to have something important that they could look forward to, something they could be proud of, was a, a flight around the moon and to beat the Russians uh, to the moon. And so uh, if there was going to be an abort, you know, if the doctors were thinking about boarding, I was going to seriously say no. The spacecraft was in good shape. There were two Born, or Anders and I were still in good shape. We knew we could accomplish the whole mission. Uh, but I also know that, that Borman had motion sickness, and that was it. There wasn't anything else wrong with him. And that, you know, he might have to grin and bear it just, you know, by himself back down there. But we were going to go to the moon.